I drove it. Earlier. I drove it. All right. Today. All right, back to camera. Ah. All right. <laughs> I'm gonna spin my cap back now. <laughs> all right, so take what, two. All right, the Riguera, you drove it today. I just drove it. I just got out of it. Hence the hair. Damn. Yeah, I just stepped out of it. So, 1500 horsepower, 1500 pounds feet of torque, not Newton meters. Damn. Newton meters is almost 2000 if you operate in that metric. That's tire shredding. Um, right there. It is tire shredding. A, a friend of mine who owns it said so you can get through a set of tires on burnout mode in 14 seconds. <laughs> Oh 14 seconds. God, that's ridiculous. But it lights it up. Yeah. Uh, first, world's first single or uh, direct drive hypercar. Yes. Yeah. And it's very funny because on the wheel there are paddles to shift with. Yeah. But you don't have to shift. There is no shifting. So what? Well, if you've if you've been driving cars that you shift with, I instinctively went to go for the gears, which which weren't there. So <laughs> that was awkward. Uh, the only reason they exist is the the conventional downshift paddle puts it into reverse. Okay. The upshift paddle puts it into forward drive. Wow. And then you pull them both in and it puts it puts it into neutral and then you can go into what Koenig's ever Seg have called it sneak EV. So Sneak EV is uh, electric vehicle mode that's capped at seven miles per hour. Oh, and the reason man. it's capped at seven miles per hour is that if it goes any faster, it's classed as a production electric car, and then oh, the homologation's right. different on the car. So that's the way so, around so got it. So the Sneak EV, which is to like sneak back at home at night without making noise. Oh, aha, uh -huh. okay. I that's can see where that's coming from. Yeah, it okay. literally comes up on the dash, Sneak EV. <laughs> what do you guys think? How would you use your Sneak EV?